Coach on the road once again, take your youngsters behind the scenes with baseball, base, baseball. And we got Ramon here. Let, let me let you introduce yourself officially to my audience. Uh, Ramon Troncoso. See, Coach Butcher, I'm good at butcher names, so he ain't going to mess with that last name. <laughs> All right, we're taking our youngsters behind the scenes of what it's like being a Major League Baseball player. So what has this experience been like for you? Uh, it's like being dreaming every day, you know. Mm -hmm. Wake up and come to work, especially this kind of job that we have. It's, it's amazing you know, to have the ability and, be, and being blessed to come and do this job. So where did this journey begin for Ramon? Uh, I started my, my career with the Dodgers mm -hmm. in LA back to 2008. And you know, every day is just more excited. Mm -hmm. you, you, where, where did you grow up at? Where, where are you originally from? I was born in Dominican Republic, Dominican? South Dominican, yes. OK, a lot of good ball players come out of Dominican. A lot of players, that's what we do, <laughs> baseball all day. So you try to make a statement over here, huh? 24-7, no, you know? 24-7, <laughs> yes, I like sir. that. Now, you know, when you when you think about baseball and this opportunity to play in the major leagues, you got a, a rare few that makes it to the big leagues. I mean, what are some of the challenges that you have to go to as a major league ball player? It's not it's not easy, you know. Come from the country that I come from, that we have to start playing baseball without gloves, without tennis shoes, sometimes barefoot. Mm -hmm. This is really tough, but, you know, all what we got in, your, in our mind is just to be a baseball player one day and doesn't matter how high is the price to do it, but, you know, we just... So who did you pattern yourself after? I mean, what major league player you looked at and said, I'm, this is my hero, this is who I'm going to be like? I, I used to watch a lot of games. I used to watch a lot of games. It was Roger Clemens, uh -huh. Pedro Martinez, uh -huh. Ramon Martinez, and they were amazing, you know. Every time I saw them pitch, and just push me, push me. And, you know, I used to coach college baseball, and I scouted for five major league teams. And I've always told guys that you can have talent and ability, but it's all about exposure, opportunity for somebody to know you out there. What did you, where and how did you get your opportunity for exposure? I think you have to be in the right spot, mm -hmm. in the right moment. First time I come up in 2008, uh, I break camp with the team, and that's how I come up. Mm -hmm. um, you know, just... Just come to work every day and try to do your job. Don't try to do too much, but mm -hmm. try to do your job, and it's going to keep you in a good position. So what's kind of your preparation? How do you get yourself mentally and physically prepared to go out and deal with a, a, a season? You know, season is long. This is what makes this sport different. It's 162 games. Mm -hmm. We have to, to do our schedule every day, and mm -hmm. Most of the time, you know, do something extra mm -hmm. to be able to survive those 162 games mm -hmm. and be disciplined with our body. Mm -hmm. You know, people think it's easy to go out here and get major league hitters out. I guess that's a bigger challenge than what it looks. <laughs> it's not easy, you know, <laughs> especially when you're playing with guys like Cabrera, Hunter, yeah. Fielders, you know. Yeah. But it's, it's mental, you know, mm -hmm. you just have to be prepared. And when you walk out on the major league field and realize some of the great great guys that have played this game. I mean, how much does it really humble you as a player to know you're on the same field as some of these great guys and put you know? Yeah, I can't explain the feeling. It's mm -hmm. something amazing, you know. Mm -hmm. Come here and see and walk in the same field where players <laughs> walked before you, you know. It's, it's an amazing feeling. And when you walk through that locker room, I mean, do you just look around and say, wow, I'm really here? It's a, it's a great feeling, and I hope I don't wake up by now. <laughs> <laughs> so are you pitching yourself? Yes. Sir. Coach, take your youngsters behind the scenes with the man, Ramon. Thank you. All right, appreciate it.